I knew Mike, he's my childhood best friend. We met each other in 94. That was my brother, I was with him every day. How do I know Mike? It was middle school. Like, I got a million Mike Bauer stories. When Mike first came to school at Attics, his first year there, nobody got backpack, nobody got books. This boy got a backpack full of books and a chili bowl and high socks. Man, who is this cat? Man, I'm saying, they like, man, that's Michael Bauer. The one that stood out was Mike Bowers. His talent was so great, he always played up. And then we went to high school together. I mean, he was good enough to play up, you know, play varsity with me. I put him top five, top three. And honestly, bro, you know, it kind of gave me chills now, you know what I'm saying? Because Mike is really that good, bro. He was, a, he was a hell of a player. Man, the dude was awesome. He came and was like, took off. By the time he was in 10th grade, he had made his mark on varsity. He was different from a lot of players I done played with. I done played with a lot of good players. His game really spoke for itself. Mike was a special player. He had some special moves. I never forget the spin move. I'm telling you, if you ain't seen it a million times, you, you, you out of there. Even if you seen it a million times, you out of there. He'll in and out your spin on you. He'll in and out your hesitate and go by you. But he was a hell of a shooter now. But I was going Mike, and Mike made a move, and he did a quick little pull up. I said, man, Mike tough. When I remember how Mike came out through the screen, stopping pop. It was, it, was, it was nice, it was hard to deal with. One play I could never forget, as he was driving, he made a behind the back pass in the post to a player, and the, as the ball was coming to the player, the player was looking at Mike like, this is a great pass, like, thank you, Mike. Like, I can't believe you're making this pass. And Mike, and the dude scored the bucket, and we was all just shocked, like, like nobody else wouldn't take that, that chance, but Mike, it was natural movement, you know what I'm saying, for him to do that. I started seeing Mike come down on the break and start dunking. When he started dunking, it was crucial. Going for a rebound, Mike put it back in. Boom! Dunking back in. Oh, boy. Man, everybody was so fired up. Mike dunking on Like, easy. Like, I go throw something in the trash can. You know what I'm saying? Because Mike ain't no big dude, you know what I'm saying? And this about outside, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, that's crazy. You know, it make you believe in amazing. He took no plays off. He had to move where he can have his elbow on your hip. You spin as you spin. Stolen, run down blocks. Man, he was doing that in high school. He was just great all around, and everybody knew him. And he would talk. Everybody just had to take it because he was he he could actually back it up. One of the proud moments be able to say that you know somebody that's great. I love him. Mike honestly is an amazing person, bro. You know what I'm saying? He's my best friend. I miss that dude. Man, we love him.